So uh, I got some good good news and then uh, bad news because bad news always seems to come right after good news, even before anybody else. And I mean, it's not before everybody because some people know, but when I go, when I comment on uh, other bloggers' channels uh, who are talking about uh, the Ukraine war, they didn't seem thrilled that um, I was telling them because they were saying, how long is it going to go on and past September? And I was like, well, you know, like it's October in mid-October. Uh, there's a non-military reason. And this is just another video that I've seen. But it was uh, the source was a, a American general, but he was saying that they can't fight in mid October because of sludge and because of uh, frost and rain and mud. It's impossible to move large numbers of men and munition and machines around. So they, because they, all of the planning that has gone in so far has been around uh, the, the wet season. And uh, it's impossible, so the, it's impossible. So they were talking about it's gonna go on for years and years. And I was like, it's gonna end in mid-October and there ain't nothing anybody can do about it. And they like, they like ignore, ignore me so they can go on talking about I hope this is gonna end and everything. Yeah, uh, so, if you're, I mean, who doesn't, first off, who doesn't hope it's gonna end? And if you can't listen to good news, if you can't hear good news and think about it and you ought to block them, you know, you ought to like edit that out, then fucking, how are you gonna act like you're happy that the war is over? Now, you were like, well, what sense does it make for me to be happy that there's a war going on? And it's as simple as it does as you're not in it. It doesn't affect you that much. You don't see it. You shouldn't go see it. If if you're being protected from seeing it, then if you will, God is protecting you from seeing it. Um, not that I don't believe in God. It's just that before six before six thousand years ago no it was impossible that there, there were other uh well you know because the argument is that those are lesser gods those are um dubious nature be careful and they uh you know what i mean like they, they were all uh fabulous uh uh dubious you know ex excess and um uh, vain and yeah yeah like that's what the stories are all about like the stories are about they're doing one thing or another like prometheus gave fire to man and prometheus is being tortured uh by birds picking out his eyes and he's chained to a volcano like yeah don't fucking worship prometheus like he's not the most high like uh, so, yeah, because um, God means gov the government, the government powers that, uh, uh, you know, when they said like a radical group of uh, ultra MAGA or something is threatening democracy and shit, you know what I mean? And they're like, it's like, uh, that's Big Brother. Big Brother was uh, the, f when he, when, when Jesus said, why are you forsaking me? And then we, we do battle with the principalities and things like this. Like he's talking about like energy commission, Silicon Valley, like things that we need that are gonna some, at some point become a problem. You know what I mean? The military industrial complex, the energy commission, I already said maybe. Uh, things that for bureaucratic reasons that make reasonable sense that people say that we need. You know what I mean? Because after a certain point in time, you're supposed to shit or get off the pot. Like you're supposed to affect some kind of, a, you're supposed to rise. You're supposed to uh, um, 
meet the challenges that um, emergency, uh, you know, like crisis, uh, and then go back to another semblance uh, or speed of life. You're not supposed to stay with the emergency pro, pro, uh, um, what's it called? Pre, see, uh, they're like protocols, you know, uh, precautions and things like, when, when there's no threat, there's no reason to take precautions. And that's the thing, it's like, you, we, we, uh, we we can uh, steal from the next generation or something like that. We can do things to make it worse for the next generation as a whole, as a whole. There's some things that our generation is responsible for. There's some gen things that the generation before us is responsible for. That's still pushing their agenda today. Like the, the boomers are still the, wear, you know, they're the ones wearing masks, the ones that wanted people to take injections and the same ones that uh, are uh, carte blanche, uh, like, uh, what's it called? They're, they're for having um, abortions up until the time that a baby's born because they think it has no soul kind of shit. Like, uh, that is extremely, like, not even as, like, extremely like, I don't even think there's women that are that like that, okay? It's just like something that Big Brother government or G-O-D in the sky li likes a a um, socially engineered society because you don't have to serve them. You can't, if, if you have, you have to serve customers. You don't have to serve socially engineered society, birthing units, you know, the... They're, they're actually, I've seen a couple of videos of babies that have been pulled out of like bags that were uh, being bo delivered outside of a woman, you know what I mean? Like, and there, everybody was like, oh, this is amazing. Like, oh, they, 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 like, it's so f wonderful how far we've come in for something, something life. And they were all into the new life and everything. And I was like, you, you, you're going to have your components. They're going to farm your components out and use you for whatever left of the, of energy that, you know, like your battery uh, until they can divorce themselves from the responsibility of keeping you alive. And then before, I mean, you would have to say at that point in time, you're already dead, even if you're still alive because you have no, pros no prospects. There's a trip how you would think that uh, the ability to have a baby and then feed a baby, you know, with your own body, like what the hell, like you have to be like a kid and go into baby talk land, which is crazy town. And then when the child grows up, uh, they stop, the child stops talking baby talk and the mother's stuck there and the mother's stuck there. So the, the men have to get her out have to go in and get her out like of a trance you know what i mean and uh i mean they they contribute genetic material like bone marrow you know what i mean henrietta lex uh donated genetic material and uh they made a episode a series about her saying that she was a political activist and uh, i mean nothing wrong with being a genetic donor of genetic material, just write a contract. Like, like uh, going back to the 1960s is in terms of being able to negotiate a, co a contract for whatever royalties and, and things and jazz, like. Uh, so, I mean, they told you some of the truth and then they're lying to you on some of the other extent because they're saying that she was out there on the streets holding a sign. She didn't even know until she was dead that the, that any develop break development or breakthrough in science in terms of extending a pathology uh, for study 
and um, because pathology does not mean the study of um, uh, what's it called the study of uh, of, of uh, suffering it does it means uh, two sides of a coin is duality the duality probably invites the su invites all that suffering you know what I mean but everything is is duality it's weird so I think we probably suffer due to the elements you know what I mean and uh, the the only place that you can experience is uh, it seems to be seems to be here isn't it like the physical or physicality so to heal is by a, a location uh find pain and alleviate sorrow alleviate sorrow that's a uh, because um things as far as uh shamanistic and you know like magic and shit like it's all either to heal uh because practice it's a practice magic and magician is a practitioner so outside outside of uh bot botanical heat herbs and things that are used for healing right you lose you lose something in your life and for it to work it'll work in some way and you lose something else and that you didn't know that you wanted. So the Tao has been called a magical system uh, or, or red, white, and blue magic has been called a ma magical system, but it's actually a Tao, a Taoism. And because Taoism, elect not to use magic, it works and it works better than magic. So it was like called, it was called magic because people were using it in, instead of, in lieu of using, you know, magic, which is ritualized and medical and, and anatomy, like here, like th ritualizing in, uh, fractions of uh, holistic science that was used for for healing. And coming up with all the perturba perturbations and shit. You know, where it's obviously not, where it's obviously used to steal rob therapy from or generate the, the need or the, the cause of the need of therapy in the first place that he has to investigate back to the beginning, back to the beginning. <clears throat> now I forgot what I started talking about. It's this uh, people pretending to want things that we, that most of us want or mentally healthy people or that you just know that because a, a normal human wants and then uh having their show talking about as it relates to the market uh and they hope you know what i'm saying and then when they ha when they find out something that should affect if you're market minded if you're if you're business minded then if you hear some information that tells you that the fighting in Ukraine is going to stop mid-October because of sledge, because they didn't start fighting until after the sledge, because they historically they can't, it's impossible, then you should want to, you should want to hear that. Because late, later on, they're going to be acting like there's this violent fringe extremist MAGA, and I don't ever even talk about that shit. I don't even get in. I don't even get. I don't even really talk about Hunter and Biden and all that shit. I don't even talk about that shit really. How many times have you seen me make a video? I mean, every now and then. I mean, maybe because there are videos, then you think that you would think that I think about that shit all the time. They're gonna. I mean, they, they're going to catch it in the neck for that. Because you can't libel and slander somebody who's not on the same type of shit that you have to be on in the first place. When when uh, you, you're moving money around for the intrinsic value, you're not wrong for wanting to know where to place.
place in a crisis to, uh, when there's a crisis, but talking to a lot of people and acting like you don't see, like you don't like like we're gonna ignore this idiot. You know what I mean? Like you're just a fucking astroturf gri grifter. So Hassan, Hassan Campbell's won the the make the mega astroturf grifter, but uh, some of the smart people that I listen to for good advice on other areas and seem like the most rational people are still um, they still get on my nerves there's still something wrong with if you can't see what is wrong it's not because of the uh, obtuse and arbitrary going tit for tat back and forth on something that's a side distraction that's not really the issue It's because uh, you they always got to throw Joe in the volcano. They always got to sacrifice somebody. And it's right in front of my face. And I know who's, I know all everybody who's all hypnotized and they're really broken. They're really broken and they're, they're using that. You know what I mean? Like, like they're, they're holding somebody hostage for what he represents or doesn't supposed to fit in with and saying that they're gonna, uh, that they're gonna do something to him. Now, I don't think so. I don't think they're gonna, you know what I mean? They don't understand the, the, the paradox about being able or not able to arrest the president because he occupies uh, an office in Washington, D.C. Is that uh, it's, it, it's not a law that you could say, oh, yep, God, I observed that like, then haha, -ha, then he's gonna walk right into a trap. It's not that. It's because when there's so much uh, covering up and shit and lying going on, that um, the legitimacy that one gets by being elected office is, is a protection for when they would normally wanna rush in like in Mar-a-Lago or whatever. They can't because he's in the white. They can't do shit. They gotta wait until you know it's all this shit they gotta do. To, you can't even come at him certain ways because he's the president. You know what I mean? It's not about like morals and about. It's not about like what's. It's not right or wrong. It's none of that shit. It's 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 not all like about uh what it should be or shouldn't be. It's about the way it is. And then they don't want to get into why it's like that because it's they're 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 not even going to read cliff notes. They don't even know why. They don't even know why they're asserting at this point in time that they're just because uh, they're mainstream and they believe in more big government. They believe in more government, which is that why you can't get to the father but through the son because there was something about the uh the the there's two lords there's the lord and of creation there's the the most high there but then there's the lowered which when jesus was talking about uh the god he said that there's something about that you don't understand that i don't think that he really likes you he said i don't think that that god likes you jesus said that he don't think God like you. What is that? What does that mean?